Hi guys. So I have some really good stress-induced breakouts going on. So I thought I would show you guys my little go-to method for covering up those pesky pimples. So I'm starting with the Graftobian color corrector. I'm gonna go in with this green color right here and just um, dab a little tiny bit. It doesn't take a lot first to correct the redness. Okay, um, I also, little sight, little trick, not related to the pimples, this is the palette that I use under my eyes all the time. Um, I take this little peachy or pinkish color and dab it under my eyes before I put my concealer on or my foundation on. Sometimes I'll mix a little bit of the yellow too. And then these are the NYX um, HD Concealer ones. They also have them in the color correcting colors, green. You could also go in with those. Um, there's a banana colored one. I am going to go in right on top of that color corrector that I just put on. And this is the NYX HD Concealer Wand. And this is number CW06. And then I just go right on top of it. Now I'm using the O1 to go under my eyes. Okay, I take this little brush from Bare Minerals and I'm just gonna bump it into the skin. So after I've concealed all of those little red zits that I had going on, I'm gonna go in with the Tarte Amazonian Clay right on top of everything and smooth everything in. I like to just put little dots so that I don't waste product by putting it on the brush first. And I missed a little zit I have going on over here. So I'm putting the color corrector on first. And the HD wand by NYX. Okay, um, and now I'm just gonna start buffing my foundation in. And then if you feel like it's peeking through at all after you've blended that, I just put a little bit on my finger of the NYX wand concealer and just gently dab it on top. Sometimes your foundation brush will just remove too much of the product. So much better. Okay. And now I'm gonna just finish with a little bit of blush and bronzer and some sealing powder. So this is the Tarte Amazonian Clay um, Bronzer. And I'm gonna go in with um, a Zoeva blush, and it's, oh, I can't really see the lighting. It's pink. And 
And then this little highlight trio came in my Ipsy bag and it's by City Color Highlight, or City Color, but it's their highlight trio. And I'm gonna use this middle color with a little bit of the pinky color. When you're putting highlighter on, you have to be pretty light-handed. A little bit on the nose. The last step is very important. It's the Laura Mercier, I can never say that, um, loose setting powder, and this is the translucent color. You guys. You have to set your foundation and your makeup when you're done so that it can stay all day. This is one of my favorite setting powders. It's so light. And that's a wrap. Pimples gone. So remember these?